A Lockheed Martin F 35B stealth aircraft of UK's HMS Prince of Wales Carrier Strike Group made an emergency landing at the Trivandrum Airport last night, after it was unable to land on its aircraft carrier after multiple attempts and was seeking an alternate landing site due to low fuel warnings, after which the F-35 was escorted safely by Indian fighter jets. Iran has claimed that the Iranian armed air defense has downed a third Israeli F-35 stealth fighter jet, and Iranian locals also shared a video of a crashed jet. On the first night of the engagement, three Pakistani fighter jets were intercepted and neutralized by India's air defense systems in forward areas, and the Indian Air Force is compiling a comprehensive dossier with satellite photos, radar tracks and electro-optical data, that will be released to the public domain in due course. Visual confirmation from fighter jet cockpit feeds also captured at least one enemy aircraft spiraling out of control over POK. Bangalore-based Hyprix Aviation has become the first private company in the country to develop and successfully test a supersonic ramjet engine, and is now working on Kira M1 155mm ramjet propelled extended range artillery shell. India and Canada have reached an agreement to share intelligence, in an effort to combat the rising threat of international crime extremism and terrorism. The Aeronautical Development Agency is collaborating with Indian private sector companies and academic institutions to fast-track the integration of artificial intelligence and autonomous systems in multiple phases for the AMCA program. The Indian Air Force is closely monitoring the development of Indian Navy's Abhiman U collaborative combat aircraft by Bengaluru based New Space Research and Technologies, that is designed to operate from aircraft carriers. Mumbai-based Max Aerospace has signed a MOU with Government of Maharashtra, to establish a helicopter manufacturing unit in Nagpur with an investment of 8,000 crore rupees. The CEO of Dassault Aviation, Eric Trappier has rejected Pakistan's claims of shooting down three Indian Rafale aircraft, and he added that to operate combat aircraft for completing a mission, and the success of the mission is not having zero loss, it is having achieved its objectives. The Indian Air Force's Apache attack helicopters have made four precautionary landings and one hard landing since 2020, and according to Aviation Focus International, many of these incidents have been attributed to heat-related malfunctions, raising concerns about Apache's performance in India's high-temperature environmental conditions. The recent image of the Cats Warrior shows significant empty space in the front fuse a large section, and integrating an Acer radar and BVR missiles could transform the Cats Warrior into a mini fighter jet, that will enable it to engage targets at extended distances. Multiple Cats Warriors can use pack hunting tactics to communicate with each other and engage threats more effectively. Industry sources have said, that the Russian Su-57 offered at half the price tag of the American F-35A, presents a potential interim solution to address an immediate requirement, while providing strategic advantages in technology transfer cost effectiveness and manufacturing capabilities, until the AMCA achieves full production capability. The manufacturing proposal at HAL's Nashik facility, and the level of source code and technological access offered by Russia would provide India with significant autonomy in operating and upgrading the platform, while leveraging commonality with the Super Shukhoi upgrade program. Today's Top 3 Comments